what is up you guys jury here and welcome back to a new video in this video i'm going to show you how you can play genshin impact on linux using steam this is going to be my third tutorial and the reason why i'm making this video again is because i have been getting some comments and i say some because there aren't a lot of comments but i've been getting some comments of people saying that uh, for example, on Heroic, the game doesn't work. Or let's just say both he like Heroic um, bottles and I believe Port Porton. Some people have weird issues of the game just not launching. Or like in Heroic, for example, one user said that when he tries to launch uh, Genshin Impact using Heroic, the launcher itself just hangs. So it shows playing stop and then the launcher just hangs and it just doesn't work now i did leave two pinned comments but the most important pinned comment i left is that you can still run the game using steam but since that comment didn't get a lot of attention i decided to make this video so if you're one of those people who cannot get the game to run on linux using heroic bottles port porton or any other launcher out there then your only viable option is steam if steam does not work for some reason then i will leave two links in the description where you can still get this game to work so without wasting your time i'm going to show you how you can get uh genshin impact to work on steam so to get genshin impact to work on steam the first obvious step is to know where you install genshin impact so for me, I'm going to open Hero Games Launcher because that's where I have all of um, the game files installed. So the best way to know where Heroic is, specifically where the folder of it is, you want to open files and then you want to go to this folder called Games. I'm sure most of you have it. So you want to open that and then you want to open Heroic. Then you want to open Genshin Impact and you want to open games and Genshin Impact game. So this EXE is what we'll be using to launch Steam. So if you installed Genshin Impact using Heroic, then you're gonna have an easier time knowing where you installed the files of the game. But if you installed Genshin Impact elsewhere, so for example, if you installed using uh, Port Porton, for example, then as you saw previously, this is where port proton is and in here you basically want to find um where you installed Genshin impact but you will find Genshin impact in here in case if you installed uh the game using port proton so basically find a way installed Genshin impact once you do then you want to open steam okay it turns out that steam is down or he's having some technical issues but once you have steam opened we want to add uh, Genshin Impact as an on-Steam game. Now, as you can see, I already have this game or I had this game already added. But as a demonstration, I'm going to show you how you can actually add this uh, game as an on-Steam game. So you want to go here and you want to click here where it says add an on-Steam game. Then you want to browse the files of the game, right? So as I already said, if you know where you installed Genshin Impact, then you want to locate the .exe of the game, right? So in my case, it's going to be in here, Heroic, Genshin Impact, then Games, Genshin Impact Game, and then you want to select the .exe. But I'm not going to do that simply because I installed this game on a different storage drive so i'm going to go here and i'm going to go to games heroic genshin impact which is just the same thing so genshin impact game and then you want to select the dot exe in this case let me just select this as a dot exe just to show you how to actually get this game working so you want to click add selected programs and as you can see we have genshin impact added so now what you want to do is you want to go to properties then you want to go to compatibility and this is where you're going to have to experiment with different uh proton builds however there is one 
GE Proton build that you can try that always works for me ever since I like added this game. And that is going to be GE Proton 9-26. So this is the one that I recommend you try out. And if the game works, that's good. If you can get into like the loading screen and if the game um, or if you um, get into the server, basically, then that's good. What you could also do here for the launch options is to pretty much add a overlay. So I'm going to type mango HUD and then I'm going to type percent command and that's pretty much it. And this is how you add Genshin Impact as an on Steam game. Now, before we launch Genshin Impact, there's one thing that you're going to have to keep in mind. And that is if there's a huge update, let's say um, you have Genshin Impact on Heroic or you have it on Boros or whatever. What you want to do is you want to open the Hoyo launcher of this. So for me, I'm going to open it right now using Heroic. And I'm going to be using Proton GE 9-26, but you can use any uh, Proton build for Heroic, right? Now, once you have Hoyo Play working, you want to update the game first. So if you have any updates available, please do that before uh, you launch Genshin Impact on Steam. And once you update the Hoyo Play Launcher and whatever files it's updating, you can now close this and then close Heroic. And once you're done, you can now launch Genshin Impact. So I'm going to do that just to show you that the game works. All right. So yeah, Steam unfortunately uh, is down, but this shouldn't be much of a big deal simply because Genshin Impact uh, saves um, all my progress through the server. So let me just try to play the game anyway. Um, but yeah, the game should just work and there we go now as you can see i am in my main account so i'm going to start the game now when you update the game through all your play using hero games launcher or whatever method you are using to update the game it's naturally going to download the resources and to verify the files and afterwards um yeah you should be able to have this option where it says click to begin so i'm gonna do that now this is the part where the game hangs and that's okay if you get a pop-up saying that steam is not responding then i recommend you click wait and give it some time and the game should just work and as you can see i'm in game so yeah everything is working just fine i can go to the settings i can go to notices and don't mind the frame fluctuation that's because i'm recording so naturally um, i'm going to get some frame drops or frame deviation but i'm just showing that the game works if i wasn't recording then the game would be pretty much smooth um, let me play a very quick gameplay. <laughs> Can't see. I hear everything. <laughs> Shine down. Unfortunately, one of my recordings got corrupted, so that's kind of unfortunate. But at least I showed you a snippet of the game actually working on steam and yeah with that being said that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did give it a thumbs up and obviously let me know in the comments if this video helped you or not and another important thing to mention is if steam does not work for whatever reason another launch i can try that i did overlook is called an anime game launcher and i will try to leave this in the video description so like i'll leave the link of this in the video description and there's another launcher out there but i forgot the name of it but i'll also leave that in the video description so at least you have two launchers you can try to get genshin impact working with that being said that's pretty much it it's your boy jury have a nice day and i am signing out